Flyers hosting the Sabres, and the Sabres are minus 115 on the money line. The Flyers are minus 104. The over-under is at 6.5 goals. The Sabres, laying a goal and a half on the puck line, are plus 195, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win this game by two goals or more. While the Flyers, getting a goal and a half on the puck line, are minus 240, meaning if you bet them that way, they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one goal, you win. The under is 6-3 and three in the Sabres' nine games, and the under is 5-4 and four in the Flyers' nine games. Now, thank you for everyone who has joined the Discord and who continues to join the Discord. If you've not done so yet, go to my website, rawsportstalk.com. Click on the membership tab. It is a paid membership, but it will give you access to my best bets and to my stats. The link is in my description and in my bio as well. Now, we're supposed to have Lukanen and Carter uh, and Hart, but neither one of the goalies have been confirmed yet for tomorrow. Head to head, the home team is five and five. The Sabres are six and four. The underdog is on a three game winning streak. The underdog is six and four on the money line, and the underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is nine and one. The over is hitting their last two games. The over is nine and one. The over six and a half goals is nine and one. And there have been three one goal games in their last 10 meetings. Uh, and let's see. None in the last four that they played against each other. They played each other twice last year. The Flyers won 5-2 in Philadelphia, and the Sabres won 6-3 in Philadelphia. The Flyers, the, the Sabres beat the Avalanche 4-0, which was a surprise to me. Lost to the Devils 5-4, beat the Senators 6-4. So it just seems like they can, they score sometimes. I guess they score in the games that you don't expect them to. I do like the Flyers in this one as a home underdog. I understand that they're on a two-game losing streak and... The Sabres are on a one-game winning streak, but I'm going to roll with the home team here. I'm going to take the Flyers with the money line. I'm going to take the Flyers getting the goals, and I'm going to go over. And this is solely provided that they don't put that abomination in Urson in net, because if they do, then go run screaming. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.